never seen you before. Wow, I've been waiting for you to show up. Thanks for coming, and welcome to our humble training hall. Jules, head trainer. If you've got some time to spare, how about a little bit of fun? Want to try taking on one of our guys? <laughs> You're not serious, are you? Look at him! He's a scrawny little thing. I could snap him like a twig. Now, now. I wouldn't judge this one by his muscle mass. What do you say, Cloud? If you want to give it a go, just let me know. So, you up or around? Ha! You're taking me on? You look like a dried up old turd. Got no idea what you get. All right. We'll settle this the tried and true tradition. Now, let's all see what you've got. No way I'm letting you win. I knew you could do it! Not bad at all. You've got this, come on! That's how it's done. Your form's looking good. I knew you could do it! Not bad at all. That's how it's done. You've got this, come on! Your form's looking good. That's how it's done. I knew you could do it! Not bad at all. That's how it's done. I knew you could do it! Your form's looking good! You've got yeah. this! Come on! That's how it's done! Your form's yeah. looking good! Not bad at all! I knew you could do it! Your form's yeah. looking good! That's how it's done! You've got yeah. this! Come on! Not bad at all! You've got yeah. this! Come on! That's how it's done! Your form's yeah. looking good! I knew you could do it! Not bad at all! Your form's looking good! You've got yeah. this! Come on! That's how it's done! I knew you could do it! Not bad at all! Your form's looking good! You've got this! Come on! That's how it's done! Not bad at all! Your form's looking good! I knew you could do it! <sighs> That it? Ah, pow! Ronnie, you know it's all about. You're too quick to judge people by their that, and your overtrained ego. <laughs> Thanks for helping me teach my boys a valuable lesson, Cloud. If you're ever up for training, our door. <laughs> That's enough of that. Should probably get back to Madame M's. If you're ever in the mood for another workout, just talk to Jay or Ronnie. You want to go, do ya? All right then, bring it on! Bringing everything I've got! <laughs> now, don't forget to breathe. Ah, <laughs> oh, shit! Not bad at all. Come on, one more rep. That's how it's done. You've got it looking good. Let me see you sweat. Your form's looking good. Not bad at all. You've got this. Come on. That's how it's done. I knew you could do it. Not bad. I have faith in you guys. That's how it's done. You've got this. Come on. Your form's looking good. You've got this, come on! No. Yeah! Feel the burn! That's how it's done! I knew you could do it! Not bad at all! Your form's looking good! That's how it's done! I know you've got more to get! I knew you could do it! Not bad at all! Your form's looking good! That's how it's done! Not bad at all! You two are doing awesome! You've got this, come on! Your form's looking good! I knew you could do it! Not bad at all! You've got this, come on! Come on! I know you've got more to get! No! Nothing to it. You did it. You really <laughs> What do you say? May I have this squat? <laughs> you up for some exercise? I won't go easy on you. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> You're better than what? I thought! You are yeah. in the zone! So, yeah, Jules! Show that sissy! Yeah. Oh, shit! Yeah. Whoa. Oh, it's, I can't get enough! 
enough of those beautiful muscles. I believe in you. Who'd have thought it'd be this close? So much training do you do? Whoa. Oh man, who's gonna win this? You are in the zone. You're better than I thought. Woo! So much training do you do? You can do it, Jules. We're rooting for you. Whoa. I believe in you. Who'd have thought it'd be this slow and steady? One, two. One, two, you yeah. are in the... You're better than that. Woo! I can hear your muscles crying out in poetry and move. I believe in you. Who'd have yeah. thought it'd be there? So much training. Yeah. I can't get enough of those beautiful Woo! muscles. I believe in you. You are huh? in the... You're yeah. better than that. Poetry and move. Yeah. You can do it, Jules. We're rooting for you. Yeah. Poetry and move. I believe in you. Woo! Slow and steady. Huh? One, yeah. two, yeah. one. Yeah. Come on, you can win this! Aww. Was never in doubt. I had no idea how strong... Listen up, everyone! We Let's hit those... You got it, Jules! I hope you will continue to help me gather vital information for my research. I look forward to receiving all of your future battle intel. How do you like a piping hot bun? Pretty rowdy. Flavor. I think this is where they step to me. Why, hey there, champ. Got word from Madam M. She said you had time to kill before. So, uh, what do you say? We've got a hell of a lot of fans clamoring to see, and something tells me they're not gonna rest. Now get on down to the Coliseum ASAP. Take a deep breath. I heard Corneo was gonna audition you girls soon. I just... Well, I do. I'll come too! Hey, Cloud! Bro, I can call you bro, right? Nope. Just wanna say, bro, that I'm totally relieved that you're looking out for Tifa. So, like, how'd you get so strong anyway, bro? I said... The way you fight, bro, huh? is like poetry and violence. Bam, bam, and it whoosh, whoosh, you know? <laughs> I really wish I could be just like you. My problem is that I tend to overthink and overanalyze everything. So, bro, do you have any advice for a smart stand-up guy like myself? No. Oh, come on, bro! Well, this is it for me. Call me crazy, but, uh, I have a feeling... Go find Aerith at Madame Mims. Tell her to wait for me there. Yes, sir! You again? Got that letter of approval you mentioned. Hmm? Yeah, it's for Eric. Who? Uh, well, either way, you're stuck out here, pal. 
I can't. Look. I wasn't asking for permission. Uh huh? Wouldn't try it if I were you. Trust me, you'd, if you even think about causing any trouble, he'll make sure. And that someone might wind up being the girl, or it could wind up being someone you've never get in. You're in the Don's world. Anyway, you've got some time yet. The audition. If you're sure you want to go through with this, then bring the. But if I were you. That's really... Yeah. Corneo's got certain tastes. This dress is so gaudy and impossible to move in. Uh, uh, yeah. Cloud? Uh, uh, excuse me. Huh. Hey, wait a minute. Did Johnny forget to give you my message? The one asking me to stay put? No, I got it. Who knows what they'll ask you to do? No way in hell I'll let you go. By myself? Oh, come on. You'll see what? Ex According to Madam M, you've caught the eye of a certain. Huh? convince him to give you his stamp of approval. You said you didn't want me going alone, right? Well, with Andrea's help, you can join me. It'll be fun. And honestly... What? It's pretty rare for Andrea to take a personal interest in someone. Trust me, this is gonna work out great. Uh... Come on! Don't you wanna save Tifa? Wait. No can do, Cloud. This is our plan, and you'll learn to love it. So, here's how I think we should approach him. Madame M said Andrea was a man who'd give anyone a fair chance to win him over. So I say we march right up to him, explain the situation, and see where that gets us. Sound good? Just don't forget about the special team. Come on! Don't you want to save Tifa? Good evening. Welcome to the end. We're here to see Andrea. Ro you must be Mr. Cloud. Mr. Cloud? I've been instructed to send you through without delay, sir. Please. What stage? The one in the back, sir. Straight through those doors and down the hall. I've dreamt of this moment. The honeybee.
Watch the stinger, sweetie. Mm. <gasps> it's easy, but I'm having trouble seeing the stick. Man, <laughs> you know what? Oh, I guess. Oh, that's a man. <laughs> you know what? Oh, I guess you. Oh, that's a man. <laughs> you know what? Oh, I guess you. Ding, 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 ding. <laughs> that's a. <r> <laughs> You did it, Boyo! I'm so nice. Hey there, doll face. We've been waiting for you. No, I'm not here. Huh? Oh, wait a minute. I think you might have wandered into the wrong room by mistake. And here's the man of the hour, chosen by Andrea himself, our honored guest. This is your first time, right? It's okay. Do you want to? Why would I want? Andrea thought it over here. Come hey, hold on. Rhythm, mister. Boop. <laughs> Take it away. <laughs> <laughs> Work it, honey. Delicious. Perfection. Work it, honey. Delicious.
Is that Cloud? Mm. Mm. Darling, I had no idea. <laughs> you now you just sit tight until Andrea takes the stage. Look at his muscles. Ah, he's flashing. <laughs> Welcome to the Honeybee Inn, Cloud. You seek my approval, do you? I understand. But those who crave my favor must first prove that they know how to move. Follow my lead.
I'm in love. Yes. Yes, I will transform you into a vision of beauty. Now, without further ado, let us begin! True beauty is an expression of the heart, a thing without shame, to which notions of gender don't apply. Don't ever be afraid, Cloud. That show today blew my mind! Did you drink Just tonight? Come over I here. can't help it. It was amazing. Drink. We can talk. Was it planned from the start? Probably not. Did you see their look of surprise? Wow. Cloud. Now that was a show. Cloud. Yoo-hoo. Cloud. Hello. Come on, Dad. Time to go home. to Cloud. Come in. Aerith to Cloud. Come in. Please don't. Not a word. Not even one? one no! But you're so help. pretty! One hot I shit. No way. Here you are. Letters from Andrea Rodea and Madam M. You serious? Is there a problem? I hope you know what you're in for. Oh, we'll be fine. If you say so. Come on. The two of you here for the audition? Second floor, at the very end of the walk. And don't go poking your nose in where it doesn't belong. Welcome to the mansion of the esteemed Don Cornea. That one's Madame M's girl, ain't it? Man, she's hot. We've been waiting for you to show. Madame Drea's girl? I'd let her do things to me. Room's at the end. Keep walking.
What's that weird, sweet smell? And why do I feel so dizzy? Gas. Come on. Damn it. Cloud. I know, thank you. Moving on. You good? Yeah, bit woozy, but I'll manage. Hey, Tifa, how you doing? Uh, okay. Oh, right. I'm Aerith, a friend of Cloud's. We were worried and thought we'd come help you out. Uh, thanks? Cut the chatter. We gotta leave. Huh? Right now. Uh, no! Not until I got what I came for. What? So, after we made it back to the slums, some guys came around asking all kinds of questions. So I did some digging. And found out they were Corneo's men. Right. They were interested in Avalanche. But I couldn't figure out why. So I thought I'd come and ask the man himself. Seriously? Thought if I could find a way in and get some one-on-one -on -one time, but then I realized, I'd only be one of three candidates, and that if he didn't pick me, it would all be for nothing. Then your worries are over, aren't they? Because the other two candidates are right here, right? Uh, right. So yeah, if we're all in on it, then nothing can go wrong. Uh, I guess not. You? Me? Cloud? Makes no difference who gets chosen, does it? I don't know, Aerith. It feels wrong getting you involved in all this. Don't even bother trying to talk her out of it. Oh, Cloud gets me. Took you long enough. <sighs> so what happens now? I think they'll call for us when it's time. This room gives me the creeps.
ladies, listen up. I'm sure you're still feeling a bit woozy, but tonight's audition's about to begin. Head out the door to the left and up the stairs. Come on, ladies, let's hustle. All right, guys, let's do this. <laughs> do you want to do this? Okay, my beautiful ladies, time to line up for the dawn. <sighs> hmm. Hmm? Wait, you look kind of familiar. We haven't met before, have we? Mm -mm. Uh, whatever. All right, y'all good to go? Then let's do this thing. Introducing Walmart's most eligible bachelor, the one and only Don Corneo. Ladies? Uh. Nice. Very nice. <laughs> Whichever one shall I pick? <laughs> Shall I pick you? <laughs> or maybe you? Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah! I've got it. Today's bride to be is. Today's? And tomorrow's, or the day after's, if the dawn takes a shine to you. Pathetic. Huh? Hey, which one of you said that? Was it you? Ooh, you got a mouth on you. I'm gonna enjoy breaking it in. Today's lucky lady is the big bone girl. <laughs> Still playing hard to get? I can dig it. Oh, yeah. The leftovers are all yours. Yeah, please! Okay. Okay, ladies. Y'all come with me. <sighs> Don't be shy, little kitten. Shimmy on over and give daddy some sugar. No need to play coy. Nobody here but you and me. Oh, you're even cuter than I thought. Back off. Ooh! <laughs> this kitten's got claws! I love it! 
What was that? Don't you worry, your pretty little head. Just a picture to preserve the moment. And to ensure you don't do anything inappropriate like say no. Asshole. Oh, phrase me more! <laughs> hey, yo, fellas! We got guests, and y'all huh? got first crack at entertaining them. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah! <laughs> Courtesy of the ever-generous Don Corneo himself, never forget the Don provides. Yeah. So, ladies, ready to get to it? Yeah. I guess I'm good to go whenever. How about you, Tifa? Mm. Four guys between us. Okay, let's not keep Cloud waiting. Right. Wait. I know you. The Coliseum! <laughs> what the hell? Get down! <laughs> <laughs> Good job, Aerith. It was nothing compared to you. <laughs> Andrea filled me in on the situation. I come bearing gifts, your gear. I'll do what I can to clean this up. Just finish the job. Uh, thank you! Okay, let's go rescue Cloud. Corneo's room, right? They're going at it right now. Lucky bastard. Let me handle <laughs> this. You can't It's over. Too late. Right here. Bring it. Bring it. Enough. Yeah. Gotcha. What are you doing here?
<laughs> Don't stop. Tell me what you a bad boy bastard. I am. You <laughs> Yes. Yes, I am. Here I come, baby. <laughs> hey, who the hell gave you permission to do that? One of you get in here and teach this bitch some manners. Sorry, but your boys had to learn some manners, too. What the? Cloud, your clothes! <laughs> oh. 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 <gasps> so you're a man, huh? What are you three up to? We'll ask the questions. Like, why'd you have men in Sector 7 asking about Avalanche? Man. Huh? Don't know what you're talking about. Don't play dumb with me. Let's try again. Why did you have men in Sector 7 asking about Avalanche? Spill the beans, or... I'll cut them off. All right, all right! I'll talk, I'll talk! <sighs> Uh, some guy with a gun for an arm. I was paid to find him. Paid by who? I can't tell you that. They'd hunt me down like a dog. Well, you better. Because if you don't, I'll rip him off. <laughs> it was the director of public security, Heidegger. It was Heidegger. Shinra. And what were they planning? Some things are better left unsaid. You know? See, I'm not so sure they are. Better keep talking. Or I'll smash them. <laughs> All right, you got me. I could never say no to a sexy girl. Since Avalanche blew up two reactors, Shinra's decided they ought to stamp them out, home base and all. And I mean, stamp out. By targeting the support pillar and blowing it up. The pillar? Did I stutter? The plate will come crushing down. It'll be Sector 6 all over again. I'm sure you've been there and seen the wreckage for yourself. So you know exactly what Sector 7's gonna look like. They wouldn't. Come on, guys. We gotta go. Before you do... No. Please, this won't take long. As everyone knows, villains only divulge their plans in a certain situation. But what is that situation? Hmm. <laughs> when they think they've already won, right? Ladies and gentlemen, we have ourselves a winner! You get an all-expenses-paid trip to the sewers. <laughs> <laughs> Enjoy the sights and smells! <laughs> are we on schedule? <laughs> the Turks are on top of it. Yes, there will be no delays. Please, Mr. President. I am asking you to reconsider. No, begging. The Sector 7 Undercity is home to more than 50,000... <sighs> Director Twisty. At least let us issue a warning, sir. The stench of the director's cowardice fills the room yet again. <clears throat> we. Progress requires sacrifice. Learn to live with it.
Where in the... Damn it, Reeks. Tifa? Oh, uh... Cloud. We have to get back to the slums right now. Yeah. I didn't want to drag Aerith into all this. She'll understand. How do you two know each other? I saved her. She saved me. Round and round it goes. And that's all there is to it. Sure there isn't something else going on? Mm.
Duty calls. Can you take over for me? It goes. Do you think it lives down here, or...? It was probably Corneo's pet. When we were dinner. <laughs> hey, you don't believe that crazy story of his, do you? Shinra wouldn't sacrifice a whole sector just to take out Avalanche, would they? Destroying part of the city, killing all those people just to get at us? <laughs> I don't know. Is Corneo the kind of guy who'd make up shit just to screw with you? I wouldn't put it past him. But if he was telling the truth, hmm? and there's still a chance he was, isn't there, then we should go. And if it turns out he was lying, then so what, right? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Hmm? Uh, <sighs> Tifa! I knew it. These tunnels are all connected. What is it? I'm pretty sure we can use these tunnels to make our way. The sewers under Sector 6 and 7 should be connected. If you get in trouble, just follow the stench. Another one of those lessons? An avalanche thing, actually. We use them to move around in emergencies. Sure we're not lost? Positive. There should be a big waterway just up ahead. Let's find out first. Lead the way.
try to stay behind me. That way I can cover your back. Gotcha. That's the way to do it. No surprises there. Is it safe to go through here? It's really dark. I'm sure we'll be fine. Come on. Hey, Cloud. Assuming Corneo was telling us the truth, what do you think Shinra's really up to? I mean, they've got to have an endgame. But I can't imagine what it is. Destroying a whole chunk of the city just to get back at us doesn't make any kind of sense. Yeah, I can't imagine any way they could profit from it. It's gonna cost them a fortune to rebuild. Corneo's lying. He's gotta be. Guys like him do it all the time out of habit. That's a power generator, all right. Wow. Talk about it. It's an antique. Older than the Mako reactors, even. It can be a miracle if it still works.
This won't take long. Deal with that. I'm coming. Okay, let's go. Huh? Huh? See ya. Gotcha. Bring it. Huh? It's over. Let's go. Wait a minute. I know this place. Sector 7 should be just on the other side of this waterway. So this is where Sector 6 ends. And where Sector 7 begins. Once we cross over, we can start looking for a way back to the surface. Might be harder than you think. Let's just try to make our way down this tunnel. See if we can't use those gates to clear a path. We can do this. We'll figure it out. Yeah, for sure. This won't take long. Not at all. All right. Get him! <laughs> I'm just so tired. Bundle up. Let's do this. Bring it! See you around. Don't hold back. Those gloves up. Sure thing, coach.
Well, this isn't good. Deal with that. I'm coming. Let me. Bang. Hang back. Bundle up. Get him. Don't stop now. I'll take care of this. Going in. <laughs> First, okay? Damn it. I can't stop thinking about what Corneo said. I know. Me too. It's gotta be a trick. There's no way they'd go that far. But... But what if Corneo really was telling the truth? We have to get there in time to stop it. We have to. Right. Aerith, what are you not telling me? Huh? Uh... Guys, come on. We gotta keep moving. Coming! I'll go first. Mm. Almost there. That was close. Thanks, you saved me. <laughs> Least I could do. Hear that, Cloud? Still thinking about the plate? Yeah. The future isn't set in stone. That's what I always tell myself. Yeah. I hope you're right. How about this then? Think of something fun. After saving Sector 7, you're gonna... I'm gonna... Go shopping. Topside. I'll buy stuff for the bar, decorations, coasters. Can I come? You'd better. Then it's a date. <laughs> <laughs> Cloud can carry all our stuff. <laughs> He'll be our pack chocobo. <laughs> what was that about me? Nothing. Sorry about that. No need to be. 